Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, back here with another video. Uh, I'm pretty sure you've all seen my last video, the Copenhagen Long Cut review. Well, after that, I had ended up uh, going to Mexico for a week. So I had no service or anything, you know. I couldn't post the video. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to post one now. Um, today, we are doing... Copenhagen wintergreen long cut if you can see that and then the expiration date for this is October 11th 2015 that's almost around my birthday shit like 10 days away well as you can tell it's a rude can this one's gonna have a camo on it but you know it's still a cool green roll with queen can you know so, today we're going to be doing a few more things and just showing off the dip. But, um, well, um, what I had a um, question to do was um, show how to pack a fatty, I guess you can say. And uh, I'm going to show how to do it right here, right here, and right here. And, uh, and now I'm going to show how to put two, like a pinch in, and then wait and then put another pinch in and get the pack together. I'm going to show how to do that too. Alright. See. I already started giving this yesterday, so I don't know but let me see something. Yeah, y'all can see that it's a real good brown, real nice texture. Also, like the pieces in here, they're pretty long. Like, see, that's like a tiny, tiny piece, and it's so long. So, I don't. My preference is that this is personally longer than the long cut. For some reason, I don't know why. It's just it feels like it. But um, you know, feel free to um, pack a loop with me, you know, if you want to. If you can keep up with me. Got all of them on top. What? Oh, now I guess. Who had that before? But as y'all can tell, you know, you can see it right here. It's pretty notice what? That's pretty big, you know, for most people. But, uh, I'm gonna fly it out. And then go to the front, you know. Yeah. Put in the front, you know. Mm. And there's a little trick on it. If you don't switch sides and you only dip on one side, I do on this side. That was like a little callus, man. If I could put one in like this and hide it, no one ever tell. But if I put it on this side, it's obvious, you know. So, if you stick to one side, you'll know, stick to one side. That's the best thing. And, um, uh, hold on, I really gay song. Okay. Um, alright, well, there's the first pinch right there. Move it right there so I can show you how to put another pinch in, please. I'm not going to take the big old pins I did in this one that I had together, but I'm going to take a pre rib one. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Look at my finger. That 
Yes, we good? Yeah. Alright. Kind of, you know, like all in there together, you know. But personally, mm. I think the best way to put a dip in or to put one in the air is either when you put it in, you know, take it, hey, set it on your lip, take your tongue. Alright, uh, and like stay on top of it, push it down with your tongue. And it should just go right down, you know. When you're done, you know, if it's fine cut, you know, just keep it in front of it, don't mess with it, because it can go all everywhere. If it's long cut like this, just, um, when you have it in the back of your mouth, hmm, hmm. Okay. If you have it in the back of your mouth, just take your fingers. And just push down on it, you know. Um, well, it's a lot of getting there, and it'll pack the air, you know. It's not rocket science. All you do is put your finger on there, put this finger behind it, and just um, push on it and push down and squeeze. And it should pack the air perfectly fine. But if you don't like using your fingers, which I don't like to either because it's nasty, you know. You don't know what you touch that day, you know. For some. Just take your tongue and push down on it. You know. But, um, yeah, it's best to be all just, um, take your fingers, you know, pinch it, you know, like that. You know, whatever your way is, take your fingers, with this four of them, um, like outline it with your fingers and push down. Make sure you feel the top of your teeth. You know, when you get the top of your teeth, push down and push, you know. And it should pack, it's fine. Now, you know, every now and then you have to make a couple adjustments, you know, with your tongue, you know. Push down, you know. But that happens all the time. Um, yeah, this winter green's a good dip, you know. Um, for some reason, all the straights and long cuts, they don't really give me a buzz anymore at winter green. I guess it's because, like, the smell or something, or, like, the flavor. It's so strong. That like, gives you a really good buzz, especially if you put your front lip. You know, my favorite thing in wintergreen is to get in the shower, you know. If you get in a hot shower, put it in. Best buzz ever. And, um. That's blue. As you can tell, I'm not flashlight. As you can see, that spits, you know, it's, it's dark, not too dark, but, you know. It's like right there. Well, I'm a little shaky. Dip makes me shake right now. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, as you can tell, you know, it's pretty dark. So, if you're at school, don't use a, don't use a water bottle for this, because it's going to be really obvious, as you can tell. But yeah, that's basically all you got to say, you know. Just going to have a stupid warning label on it, too. Warning, this product can cause gum disease and tooth loss. That's bullshit. I haven't lost a tooth yet, and I haven't got gum disease yet, so I'm still good. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's shanky, you know, gum disease, it's stupid. But, um, yeah, next week, uh, let me see, where is it at? This is one of my empties, but, um, next week, I'll be dip reviewing this right here, Cocaine and Snuff. Uh, Yeah, we'll be reviewing some of that. Uh, you know, that's a good dip. You know, it's really fun. But um, yeah, guys, you know, please subscribe. Tell your friends. You know, if you have any comments, you know, comment below. Um, y'all have any serious questions? You know, you know, ready to see it? Just um, email at the coke dippers at gmail.com. 
And, um, yeah, that was fun, you know. And, you know, follow me on Instagram, you know. Outlaw Dipper 22. No underscores, nothing. Just Outlaw Dipper 22. And, um, it's just a picture of me holding a deer, you know. And, um, uh, yeah, guys, I'll be back either by this Monday or something. I'll be back sometime this weekend. I'll post another video. But, you know, if y'all want me to review anything else, just, um, comment, you know, let me know. Alright, guys, I'll see y'all later.